Hi, hope you guys are well. Um, today I'm going to do a quick one about what steps you need to take in order to become better in English. So it doesn't matter where you are at the moment, you need to uh, learn a few things. These are very basic things, but you need to make sure the basics are taken care of. So you might be thinking maybe I need to improve on this, I need to improve on this, I need to work on these kind of things. But um, I suggest to you to maybe look at the basics. So if, if you take anything, basics are the most important things. So if you get the basics right, then you can go a long way. So you get to the next level afterwards. But if you get the basics right, that's what you need to work on now. So uh, one of the most important things for you to know is that uh, we, when we try to talk, we talk about ourselves, we talk about me most of the time, and about things around us, and about people around us. So you need to learn to talk about you and the things around you. So uh, when it comes to talking about you and the things around you and the people around you, uh, pronouns are very important. You need to learn how to use pronouns, different pronouns in different ways. Say for example, you need to know how to say uh, I in a sentence. I. I am Chiminda. I come from Sri Lanka. I live in London. I love to eat ice cream. So I, using the word I, is very important because you have to talk about yourself a lot. So this is one main important thing that you need to learn. And then me. The second thing is me. He gave me some biscuits. He, uh, she came to see me. So me is another word that you need to learn. So uh, uh, something that I suggest you to do is write down a few sentences, uh, as, as many as you can, and then memorize them. Try to say them aloud. You need to practice. Practice key makes you perfect. So this is very important. And then talk about he, she, it. So when it comes to he, she, it, you have to make sure you use the, the grammar correctly. So for, for example, I go home. He, you can't say he go home, you have to say he goes home, or she goes home, or she eats. So the way you say is different. So this is very important. So you have to practice these kind of things. So the more you practice, the better you get. So this is very important. I hope you guys understand. So this is a very, very small one, but I hope you will get something out of it. I'm going to uh, talk about a tip that I used long time ago, but it's very effective talking to yourself. I know it sounds crazy and if someone sees you talking to yourself they might think oh these are the first signs of madness they say talking to yourself right but it doesn't matter you're talking to yourself in English so that will make you better that you will change your way of thinking that will accelerate your thought process and then because you're thinking now in English and you're trying to talk yourself so you have to think you have to create things you have to tell a story so storytelling is a very good thing that you can do but you have to talk to yourself because there's no one to listen to most of the time so you might as well just say something to yourself it doesn't matter so you say okay um, you know what happened so you are practicing that's what you're doing so you think okay you have to go and speak to this person say it's a date you have a date but you want to say something the best thing you can do is you practice so you know you know what happened i went to this place and it was so beautiful i had a really good dinner blah 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 so you have to practice so that's how you um, do better in your date so that's uh, one thing that you need to learn because when you know English, it's, it makes it much easier for you to win in a lot of places. So I suggest you practice, but talk to yourself. You can look in the mirror, that's a good thing. And then so you see how you look like. If you're smiling, if you're stressed, if you're scared, if you're 
joyful or if you're dull or boring or um, not not looking very happy kind of thing so it's better to look in the mirror and then talk to yourself so you're talking you're asking the question and you're answering okay hi how are you today and then you're like oh I'm very well thank you how about you so you're making the conversation because it's hard to find a partner for you to practice and um, therefore the best thing you can do is practice by yourself once you get better at talking to yourself then you can maybe find a partner so this is a good tip so if you can start doing that from now from today just talk to yourself maybe for one minute maybe two minutes I'm talking to the camera so it's I'm just talking to myself as well so it's the same thing so I'm looking at the camera and I'm talking to myself basically there's no one in front I'm assuming that someone will watch it but there's no one now so it's the same thing so I hope you guys will learn something from this and um, if you haven't subscribed or if you haven't joined our group it's a good thing um, join in the group we are going to do some exercises every week so you can participate and get better at speaking English it's very important it's you participate it's not about joining the group nothing will do by joining the group but if you practice if you participate I promise you you'll get better so I'll see you um, soon in the group come into the group and then send me a message say hi to me love to say hi to back to you I will definitely say hi back to you and then discuss with me send me your problems what are you struggling with what do you want to improve maybe we can help don't worry about you know oh, they might charge no don't worry everything on the Facebook group is free so it's it's, it's, a, it's a, a good opportunity for you so make sure join the group and then say hi to me I'd love to say hi to you guys so see you soon take care